is locked away for the Lexus Melbourne Cup. Stand by for a start. They are ready. Locked away. Gates are back and they're racing. They're off in the cup and Knight's order towards the outside. The best to jump with Val and declared due a smoke and Romans isn't too far away. And also Kamora showing speed without a fight. The international in the yellow jacket is also up there with the leaders across the track in the first two or three hundred meters. Poking up his grand promenade from barrier number one also. Interpretation drives up to lead with Smoke and Romans, Val and Declare and Grand Promenade. Kamora without a fight out even deeper. And Knight's orders about seven wide at this stage with Serpentine out there with him. They were followed by Val and Declare and back in the field, Stockman and Dewis, an emissary from Hu Yamal. Then came Young Verda, who's a little keen three wide. Next in the field, Roma Flowers, and then came Gold Trip, High Emotion. Then Deshaun Sweet Jr. Second last off the rails is Montefilia. And at the end of the field, settling down into stride is Arapaho as they leave the straight with 2,200 metres to run and the favourite Doville legend midfield. So Smoke and Roman Serpentine leave the running with Serpentine going to the lead. Interpretation third. They were followed by Kimura. Tralee Rose is off around them now. Three wide to improve her position. A length Grand Promenade without a fight. Numerian, a length Doville legend. Then came Knight's Order, who couldn't quite get in three wide. A length away, Val and Declare, Emissary. Next is Jewish Stockman, and then Hu Yamal. Realm of Flowers is one off the fence. Around that runner is Young Verta. Then came Gold Trip to Shan Sweet Jr., Higher Motion, Montefilia. And at the end of the field in the Lexus Melbourne Cup is Arapaho. 1,600 metres to run, and the leader is Serpentine. By a length and a half, Tralee Rose. Two further back in the field is Smoke and Romans getting a gun run on the outside side of interpretation three lengths Kamora a length grand promenade and then came without a fight a length Dover legend tucked away on the fence Knight's order continues his run three wide a length away Numerian midfield Dewis and then came Emissary Bow and Declare further back Young Verta then Hu Yamal and Stockman next in the field gold trip two thirds down to Sean Sweet Jr well back on the fence Montefilia is getting moving then came higher motion realm of flowers and Arapaho is last Serpentine at the thousand meters to go just led from Tralee Rose Knight's order is going to try and set the cup alight and moves up three and four wide and goes to the front early Smoke and Romans going with him so as they reach the 800 meters and Knight's order has taken off two links in front of Smoke and Romans daring tactics without a fight slid up to third Doval legend got to fourth they were followed by Dewis Tralee Rose in reverse then came Ralva Flowers to the outside next young first a gold trip, but Knight's Order is going to try and break their hearts in the Lexus Melbourne Cup at the 450, led by two leg smoke and Romans. Here's Doval Legend presenting, and gold trip down the outside. Emissary is behind those. Gold trip moves up, takes the lead from Doval Legend. 250 metres to go. Emissary running on. Gold trip, 150 metres to go, wondering about getting tired. Emissary is trying very, very hard, but gold trip is brave. Next to finish in the race, Realm of Flowers to Sean Sweet Jr. Then came Stockman, Bauer, Declare, Arapaho, Spoken Romans, Knight's Order. Then Grand Promenade, Bonifilia, Hu Yamal, without a fight, Young Verda, Tralee Rose, Dewis, and some tired horses walking over the line. Numerian, Serpentine, and Kimura will not complete the course. Gold Trip has won the 2022 Lexus Melbourne Cup, giving Kieran Ma and Dave Eustace their first Melbourne Cup victory and a first win in our most famous race for jockey Mark Zara, carrying number one saddlecloth and 57 and a half kilos after a gallant second in the Caulfield Cup. Gold Trip has gone one better in our greatest race. It was a dominant staying performance. Emissary has run a huge race in second and high emotion. The stablemate to the winner has come from last to flash home for third. Doville legend, the favourite, a weakening fourth in the Melbourne Cup, but Gator 
What a training performance by Kieran Maher and Dave Eustace to get goal trip home in the Melbourne Cup. Yeah, look, it's the day Kieran Maher and Dave Eustace will never forget, isn't it? And uh, look, he's done a great job because there were queries on him at the 3,200. There were queries on him. Can he carry the 57 and a half and still beat them? Oh, he's only won one race. Maybe he's not that good. Well, wrong. He was just as strong as anything on and through the line. A powerful performance gave him all weight and a beating. Emissary terrific. Dope legend. Probably beat himself being so keen early. He loomed to win it. He didn't quite run the, the 3,200 out strongly. High emotion, you've mentioned as well. But it's all about the winner and gold trip. And it's all about Mark Zara. He finished second in the Caulfield Cup, second in the Cox Plate. Britt, he's now won our greatest race, the Melbourne he Cup. He certainly has, Mark Zara. Congratulations to you. Try put this feeling into words. Oh, I can't. It's like crying. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Unbelievable, what a day. <laughs> That's the word that so many jockeys who have won this great race use. Unbelievable. <laughs> what went through your body as you crossed that finish line? I bet that oh. last hundred felt like yeah. it went an eternity. It did, you know. I, I got to the front a bit, a bit soon, but I, he's a horse that when you go for him, I really want to go for him, you know. I don't give him a chance to think about it. And, uh, yeah, that last hundred, I was thinking, it's just piss off it. No one come near me, you know. And, uh, oh, it's just elation, absolute elation when you cross the line. How long have you dreamt of winning a race like this, the Melbourne oh. Cup? <laughs> I've never really thought about it, yeah, to be honest, but um, yeah, don't have to dream of it anymore, I guess. <laughs> this is reality now. Did you watch this race growing up as a kid? Yeah, absolutely. Mum used to give us uh, the day off so I could watch it. So, uh, yeah, it's just surreal, absolutely surreal. <laughs> Do you have to pinch yourself to think there's kids at home who've had the day off and they're watching you right now? Yeah. This is your chapter. Absolutely. My little one's at home. My wife is here and uh, all the folks back at uh, WA just... Uh, <laughs> Oh, what an amazing feeling. <laughs> you have no idea how what WA will be going on for you right now. Congratulations. You are a Melbourne Cup winner. Cheers. Thanks, Rudy. Well oh. done. And Kieran Ma is the toast of the Melbourne Cup. Kieran Goldtrip.